Hi, it's Eric, and we're going to take a look at this watch, the Skurfa Diver 1. So, I think this watch is easily the most affordable, serious dive watch you can buy. This is around a $350 watch uh, with a helium escape valve built by a diver. So uh, this is a fantastic watch. The bezel action's great. There's a lot of things that are really nice about it. Yes, it has a quartz, it has a Ronda quartz, a Swiss quartz. Uh, very reliable, great, but for $350, this is a PVD coated one. You can get all different types. And this is one of the least expensive ones I believe you can get. It's a great watch. It's an amazing watch. It's a great grab and go. And uh, as I mentioned, it's made by a guy named Paul Skirfield, uh, who is a saturation diver. So he wanted to make something that was affordable. It's funny because as one of the consequences of this watch is being made is that the rubber bands that come on this watch, a lot of Rolex and Tudor people buy them. It's just pretty well known that people do that. People like the rubber straps that come with this. this. So it comes with a rubber strap. I also bought the, the, the metal um, bracelet and we're gonna go into greater detail on why this watch is so great. And it's definitely the most affordable, best dive watch you can buy. So let's take a quick, closer look. And here is the Skurfa. Let me help if I turn it up the right way. So this is a single domed uh, sapphire crystal. So there's a little distortion. Um, and you can see the AR in this. Uh, but this is a 500 meter watch. 500 meters uh, with a helium escape valve. Uh, I told you it comes with the really beautiful rubber uh, rubber strap. I chose to buy the, uh, the extra... Um, stainless strap for it. This is PVD coated. I think it's around 300 bucks. I think delivered even to the States is like 325, something like that. But the loom is amazing. The also what's really amazing about this is the bezel action. It's really smooth, super exact. It feels like there's a rubber gasket underneath it. It's beautiful. It really is great. Uh, it's 40 millimeters. This is easily wearable all the time. It's 14 millimeters thick um, and uh, it's just super wearable. Really amazing. Uh, seven millimeter crown, screw down, three gaskets. Uh, as I said, the Ronda quartz with the end of life indicator. Um, this kind of has everything that you need and this is just I think one of the greatest deals out there for sure. It's a beautiful watch for a great deal. I highly recommend it. Uh, the Loom is fantastic. Lasts all night. Uh, it's a last all night bright, as I would say. So it's just, I think it's an amazing watch. Still at uh, an amazing price. So there's your Loom shot. So here it is on a seven inch wrist. Uh, this is ultra wearable. I mean, it's just a fantastic watch for everyday use. Uh, I just think, it's an amazing, amazing value. Uh, 40 millimeters, obviously it works for everyone. And at a 500 meter diver, 500 meter diver with a helium escape valve and that huge thick crystal and the AR and the, the loom, you just can't beat this. So let's take a look on a suit. So here it is on a suit. Um, Obviously, this is very wearable. None of the challenges with a lot of the other dive watches that I've been using. It's just a great watch. Uh, easily fits under a cuff. This is a daily wear. Easily a grab and go. Always be ready to go. Uh, fantastic watch. Just love it. So there you go. Uh, the Skurfa uh, Diver 1. It's a great watch. Uh, it's a great watch to get for a first dive watch that's actually built by a saturation diver. I know people love to argue with all these type different points about dive watches. Well, I don't think you really can with him. The guy is a saturation diver for a living. He offers this watch as a watch that's affordable and a capable dive watch, and it is. It is. Um, everything from, you know, the way it's built to, you know, to the lens, to the, the, uh, the bezel is, is fantastic. It's a great watch. I mean, how can you beat it for 350 bucks? There's nothing that comes close to this thing. So anyway, I'm a, I'm a big fan of it. And uh, if you like this kind of content, please like and subscribe. Thanks. Do that, do that, done.